Hello everyone, welcome back to Data Movers. We are bringing you a special edition of Data Movers, our podcast and video series focusing on digital infrastructure, the next generation of digital infrastructure, the next, the future of the sector really. And we are coming at you from Cannes, France, where we are attending Data Cloud Global Congress. Very excited to be here. And so I am here with Julia Schubart, who founded Orion Industries. So we're really excited to get into this a little bit. I'll just jump right in, Julian. Julia, so what inspired you to pursue a career career in this industry? Simply put, uh, the digital infrastructure industry is uh, imp at the core of empowering the AI revolution across every sector, right? So 50% of all S&P 500 companies have, in their latest earnings calls, uh, mentioned AI and the rollout of the data centers has been compared to the impact and uh, build out of the railway network in the industrial revolution. So working and setting a foot into the industry uh, really fascinates me given the you know being at the forefront of technology progress and ultimately uh, at the advancement of humanity uh, is something I, i'm really yeah fascinated by excellent well i'm so excited to hear about the passion and obviously that's why you're you're founding a company in the industry right um, i feel like we're getting in the in on the ground floor for for arian so thank you for doing this um and the second part of that question how has talent in tech helped you so far yeah, talent and tech has been exceptional so far, and I would say yeah, instrumental in kind of broadening my my un, my holistic understanding of the entire ecosystem, uh, connecting here with kind of the global leaders in the in the industry who really kind of shape and drive uh, yeah this, the innovation and change, uh, and I'm really excited to be here. Excellent. Okay, great. So this is a fun question and a very kind of theoretical, get you thinking. So 10 years from now, what changes do you hope to see in the way our industry approaches sustainability and innovation? Yeah, so I actually thought a lot about it. And I think, you know, the, the, obviously the, the rapid growth of the industry has been uh, driven by kind of a nearly all out efforts on kind of keeping up with the demand. So from, from, from the next 10 years, I really kind of hope to see that environmental impact and energy efficiency uh, in kind of running and operating data centers, not just in Europe, but globally become kind of top priorities. So it's not just about buildings bigger, but building smarter and greener. We couldn't agree more. Yeah, building smarter and greener, absolutely. And so last question, if you had to describe your talent and tech experience in just one word, what would it be and why? Which I guess you need more words for that part. <laughs> transformative, okay. truly transformative, I would say. Uh, and why is that? Because here you, you kind of clearly have access um, to kind of the, the entire ecosystem, uh, the global stakeholders who drive regulations, who drive uh, the investments in the industry who really kind of, uh, you know, drive the industry and kind of determine how the next 10, 15, 20, 30 years are going to look like. So very excited uh, to be here, but also kind of learn how my skills, interests and passion align with the needs in the industry. So excited to be here. Thank you. Perfect. It's starting to rain on us a little bit. So I think we have to wrap up. But thank you so much, Julius, for joining us on Data Movers. And thank you to our viewers for hanging out with us in Cannes, France, for the special edition of Data Movers. Not the weather we were hoping no, to see. No, no. Mm -hmm. It was beautiful yesterday, though. So we'll take it. Happy networking, everyone.